morning guys it's about 3 30 in the morning morning guys <laughs> it's about 3 30 in the morning <laughs> we are getting ready to go on a long ass road trip to buffalo buffalo because my baby's going to buffalo because we're probably going to buffalo probably don't get punched till early in the morning so we oh it's kind of dark over here so we are just going to go to the school, pay it a visit, so we know where he's gonna be, meet his coach, so it's exciting. I'm not gonna cry, I'm not gonna cry, I'm not gonna cry. Are you excited? Oof. Mm -hmm. Morning. Look what we found in our travels. Hot air balloons. How romantic to watch the sunrise. I wouldn't do it, but it's pretty cool. Here we are. It is 5.20 in the morning. So we've only been driving for about an hour, right? But we're doing good. We beat traffic. The morning rush hour in the city. In half a mile, keep left at the fork. Follow signs for I-287 North, I-87. It says we're going to get there at 11 a.m., so, so far so good. Kids are in the back. Brennan is literally laid out on the floor. There's a huge third row back there, but... Keep left at the fork. We're going to stop soon because I need coffee. I need to function. We are in this cute little town. Not sure what the name of it, but look what they did for the seniors. Yeah. Uh, Class of 2021, there's some pictures of the seniors all over the poles, the light poles. It's so cute. All right, I love my life. I love my life. Look at this guy. <laughs> this is when you know it is a small town. Mm -hmm. Attica Street that way. Oh, down there. Penitentiary. Shout out to my homies. Mm -hmm. Wow, these things are Huge. massive. I haven't seen them on TV. Wow, I didn't even know they're that big. Wow. And then on that side too. Wow. This video does not do it justice. There's no way. Ah. like the main hotel in the city at one point it was like the party but now because of covid it's just so run down it's like a ghost town I it was so pretty there's the atrium this is crazy this looks like a oh the game room Look how big the bar area was. Well, it is. This bar looked like it was popping. It's just empty. I mean, I would not stay in overnight. This is a good pit stop hotel. I'll show you this big ass room upstairs. It looked like a club. 
look how cool. Massive ballroom. I mean, I don't, honey, it's creepy. Oh, no, no, baby. Oh, no, this is creepy. Look how huge that is. It's creepy. Obviously, this hotel needs some updating, but. Well, the foundation is definitely here. The right inv investor needs to come in and just flip it. Flip it. When we have a giant hotel ever. There's the pool. That's that little area right there with the ballroom leads out into that area. Open oh, yeah. Come on. The courtyard yeah. there. We made it. Just checked into the hotel. I don't want to sound bougie, but it's doing its job for right now for a pit stop. Oh, you can't see the town from here. So we made a pit stop at a hotel to freshen up. Change the fit. Buffalo, here we go. Brad, you excited? Yeah. BSU. I got to figure out what their tier is. The Bengals. Go Bengals. Go Bengals. Friend, say hi to my YouTube. It's my baby, y'all. You going to college? You going to college? I'm going to keep it together. All right. Here we are. This is so exciting. Medium-sized basketball court. Pit stop over. On to the tour. Hey. So we concluded our tour around 4.30, quarter to 5. I was having a jam session the whole way here, so I couldn't record in the car really, and I was also the co-pilot. But we are home now. You know, Brendan has a lot to think about, so... Well, I hope that he does decide to go to, you know, Buffalo State College. I kept saying Buffalo State University. I was confusing it with University of Buffalo, but it's a great facility. Everything is renovated. Um, so let's see what happens. But regardless, whatever he decides, I'm proud of him. We have to be proud of our kids and support their decision. So we'll see what happens. <laughs>